What's up, Daddy Divas and Divos? It's your girl, April. Girl. So this is going to you be another not. try on and review for my thoughts on this company that I was contacted by, which I do think that their name is pronounced AMI Clubwear. I'm not really sure. Some people call it AMI Clubwear. Some people call it AMI Clubwear. Either way, you guys, I will post the information for you guys below and any codes that I may have. And so, I have seen this site forever and always wanted to buy stuff, but just never got around to it. They have like the hugest shoe collection, but unfortunately they don't have a lot of shoes in my size, which is a size 11. So a girl is limited. So I went and I checked out their plus size section and their clothing chart was a little bit off to me Meaning I was like wait a minute that is not the size that it should be So I went on YouTube and I checked out some reviews their sizes run super small like really really small and um on top of that, I really wasn't like too pleased with the quality of the clothes. And I'm gonna just be honest, you know what I'm saying? Like, I understand that a lot of people probably be like, well, you shouldn't act like this, but it is my opinion. I'm entitled to my opinion. So you guys are gonna get my opinion. Their sizes run really small, okay? Super duper small. And on top of that, like, so they had like this huge sale, really, really great sale. And I was like, oh, okay, I'm gonna get this and I'm gonna get this. Well, a lot of the things by the time the girl was ready to ship my stuff out, they didn't have my size or they didn't have the color. And I would have really rather them send me an email and be like, look, listen, um, April or Muffins, we don't have this in your size or we don't have this in your color. Would you like to choose something else or would you like me to send you a size up? I wasn't given that option, so they sent me the colors that I didn't choose and the size that I didn't choose. And my thing is, if I wanted that color, I would have asked for that color from this jump. But it's not that I'm ungrateful. I just, this is my opinion. The plus size section and the options for plus size variety on that website is very limited. Like, there is not a lot of things. There's probably like three pair of pants and a couple of shirts and some dresses. And to me, in my opinion, I'm really not with those styles. Um, it kind of looked old and outdated to me. And I just really wasn't with all of it. I did get these um, velour type of slippers. The ones that I originally wanted were not pink, they were black. Um, I just thought that the black ones looked a lot better. Um, in pink, they looked a little bit cheap and cheesy to me. Um, they were $25. They're not really made that well for $25. Bucks. They're hot glued on the side. I could see the glue on them. And I was just like, oh, okay. This is just my honest opinion, okay, about the website that the items to me are kind of like pricey for the quality that you're getting. Then, okay, so now we're gonna get on to what I'm wearing. So let's get into this. So the dress that you see me wearing is this green, mint green dress. It wasn't the color that I originally wanted. The color that I originally wanted was like a nudish color. And like I said, they run small, so I had to get a 2X. Well, I guess the color wasn't in and neither was my size. So she sent me a green one in a, a size 3X, okay? So it was a little bit big, but not too bad. Um, as you can see, they run really small. All in all, it looked cute. It ended up being really cute, and I liked it. Um, it wasn't too tight. Only thing is, I don't really like stuff on my neck for too long. But other than that, it's made really well. I like the lace of it and the flow. So if I have somewhere to go, I definitely would wear this, especially because it's comfortable, depending on what time of season it is. Because like I said, I don't really like a lot of things on my neck. I do like the keyhole opening in the front and in the back as well. It does have an opening also. Um, but for the price, of it i think like the sale price is an honest price of, but if it wasn't on sale i don't think that it was really worth like the original price of this dress but either way it was still cute and i appreciated it okay so the next dress when i seen it on the girl on the website i was like oh this is really cute so it is the color that i wanted but like i said she must have ran out of sizes or whatever but or maybe she thought that i didn't know my size either way she sent me a 3x in this i think this one was my favorite out of all of the dresses this white one was my favorite because in the middle it's lace and it has like this antique white lace and then the rest of it is white um so i think like this was actually my favorite piece out of the entire set i know once i wash it it's probably going to get small um, but I did really like this dress. I think it looks really cute on me. And um, I felt like I was a little bit more elegant. But other than that, I thought this dress was really, really cute. So 
Now I gotta find somewhere to wear it to. This floral bodycon. So this is the only one, or I think, yeah, this is one of the ones that came in my size. Um, now this is the off the shoulder one. Like me, you could either wear on the shoulder or off. It all depends on you. It's very stretchy. I got it in a 2X. That is the size that I asked for. And as you can see, it's rather tight. Now if she would have sent me a 3X, it probably would have fit just as nice as well. I love the way it looked on me. I do have a body shaper on underneath it. I felt like a million bucks in this dress. And like I said, this is the color that I wanted. It did come in like a peach, like a blush. And I just like the floral print in it a lot. Either way, it's still really, really cute. So the next dress is this red wrap dress, and it has a tie waist belt on it. The size that I have is a 2X, and it's really cute. It's like a faux wrap dress, which is cute because I used to love dresses like this back in the day. Um, for now, I don't know if I would really wear this type of dress. Like I said, for plus sizes, their selection is very, very limited. Anyway, but the red dress was cute. You know, I really don't wear a lot of red but I like this color red it went really well with my complexion but yeah I did run a little bit too small so now on to the bathing suits I got three bathing suits let me tell y'all something neither one of them fit the only one that I was able to try on was this black one as you see right here um this bathing suit is actually a 2xl um I had to really pull this up over my leg area because it was cutting into my skin and I'm sorry but I really don't like nothing cutting into my legs that makes it very uncomfortable it does have the padding in the breast area Area. so if your boobs do not sit up then you at least you have some support but it was kind of tight all underneath the arms and everything like that the design was super cute but it was a very very small it runs super small so I ended up giving this to my 15 year old daughter because like there was no way that I could wear this and be comfortable so, and so I, they sent me an extra large in this bathing suit right here there's no way I could put this on I wasn't even trying to when I first took it out the box I was like um yeah that is is not getting on you girl it's a really cute bathing suit it's really small it's an extra large I asked for a double XL and so I guess it's like well we're just gonna send her this and then the last one um like I said same thing same issue they sent me two sizes up in a bathing suit and it was really cute like I was all for this bathing suit but <laughs> It's way too big. Like, they sent me two sizes too big. And the cup size is like, girl, I wish. Like, I wish they could fit in this. So, when I seen this, all I had to do was look at the cup size and was like, there's no need for me to even try this on because my boobs are not going to fit in here. Meaning, um, I could put two of my boobs in one side. Like, this thing is huge. So, I didn't even bother to try this on at all. It's really cute, though. It's, like, super, super cute. So, yes, that is my review on AMI Clubwear. Unfortunately, you know, there was there's two things that I liked out of the entire review. Other than that, I just feel like, in my opinion, that their clothing is too highly priced for the quality. But, you know, if you're in the smaller size, then definitely check them out. They have a lot of clothing. And if you are an exotic dancer, Sir, meaning a stripper because ain't nothing wrong with that for some dollars get you get make them holler okay they have loads of different kind of shoes and club wear for dancers so i think like that is beneficial by far it, you know i'm not a dancer i get i get too hot and too tired too fast i'll be all out of breath but if you guys if there's somebody who's watching who is a dancer definitely check them out they got some bomb bomb ass clothing for dancers so yes you guys i hope you enjoyed this video stay diva and divalicious make sure you rate comment subscribe i'll see you guys in this soon to come video